Hello, and welcome back to Code in 5 Minutes with Zim. I'm Dr. Abstract, and in this Code in 5 Minutes, we're going to see how we can pack shapes. So let's go to the Zim site now at zimjs.com. We'll press on Code and copy our template. Okay, we'll paste it here into Adam. And let's see, we can say this is going to be pack shapes. So we had this this request from a, uh, from Carl on the forums, and he showed us an example where a bunch of shapes were randomly all over the place. And we're going to put this on purple, purple, and we'll dot darken. These shapes were all over the place, and then they uh, they all sort of animated. We press on the stage, they all animate to a nice order on the left-hand side of the screen. So we thought about how we could do this, and it seems that it would make sense to start off with a tile all in order. Then we record the start X and start Ys of those, and then we randomize them all over the place at different uh, different scales as well. And when we press on the stage, we animate back to the start X and start Y and a scale of one. <laughs> so that's uh, that's how we're going to do it. That's a lot of coding that we're going to try and do here in five minutes. So let's start the timer. There she goes. And we will say const tile is equal to a new tile. And we'll tile either a new rectangle or we'll tile a new circle. Come on, new circle. And we will tile how many of these? Rand, 10 to say 20 of them. This is the calls and the rows are rand 20 to 40. So we'll make the rows more rows so it's taller than it is wide and we'll give um, a, a separation spacing of 10 and 10. Then we will dot scale this to scale to the stage, 90%, uh, 90%, although I think we'll just scaling it in the height pretty well. And we'll dot pose this um, 30 from the left and zero from the center. So left and center on the stage. There we go. And let's have a look in browser plus. So there they are. Refresh again. Okay, so they're all on the left, but why don't we give them some color? Mm, this will do with style. Style is equal to color, and we'll do pink, blue, and green. So we're going to randomly pick between those, but we want to apply it later, so we want to delay the pick. Delay pick, colon true. Otherwise, that, that style would get applied to the, the, um, the tile itself. Uh, I want to spell the word true. That would get um, applied to the tile itself, and we want to wait and apply them to these, and we get something like this. And then we'll also set the reg, and we'll want the reg in the center. So positions properly as we scatter this. And so now we scatter them, and that would be tile dot loop. And we'll call this arrow function. In that arrow function, we will get each of the shapes because we're looping through that. We'll record the start X and start Y. So shape dot start X. This is what we're making is shape dot X. And we'll copy that for the Y as well. All right, now we scatter. Um, shape dot loc at some rand the stage width, comma, rand, the stage height, height, and let's see what we get. Oh, uh, we have to divide by the scale, so that is divided by the tile dot scale, uh, like that, and that'll go across the stage, uh, well enough, I think, anyway, yeah. Okay, so they're kind of everywhere. Oh, but let's change the scale too. So we'll um, dot ska those. Mm, one, two, three. Okay, dot loc. Okay, that gives us a, a little <laughs> dot ska comment, rand, rand, one, two, three. There we go. Okay, good. Good enough for now. We might want to put a border in on that, but let's do our stage press now. So this is stage dot on. 
uh, quote stage mouse down and we'll call this arrow function and on the arrow function we will loop through the shape again loop through the shape this time we'll collect an eye though that eye will be important as we animate a delay and now we're going to animate dot animate um, the props will be the scale to one the x to the shapes dot start x and the y to the shapes dot start y uh, good um, how's that looking and uh, the time now so let's just have a look when we press on the stage they all go back to the start x and start y we might want to loop in reverse there true so the top one goes on and also let's um change it so that we have a uh a wait so we're going to wait um i times the point zero one or something like that so this will wait a little bit before it does that as long as we put a comma in there and here we go there they go except i think we want a total so let's get the total here and actually do it a total minus i uh, times and we stop the talk uh, stop boop <laughs> well 501 <laughs> That was that was just me reaching uh, reaching for the timer. Oh, did I turn the timer off? I'm sorry that uh, that showed it at 5:01. <laughs> you ready? Here we go. And there they all are, all over the place. Ooh, very nice. Whoosh! <laughs> Wonderful. We can maybe speed that up a bit, huh? Uh, let's change that to a point zero zero five. And is there anything else? We could add an ease as well, if you don't mind. Ease colon. How about a back out? All right, you ready? Be nice to have a border. Yeah, there, that's better. Whoa, cool. All right, this has been a, a code in five minutes. Uh, yeah, I could have used a border on that. Border color colon white maybe border width colon two hopefully you don't mind yeah that looks better we didn't quite get the um random all over the uh random all over the place either we have to subtract a little bit there probably something like uh minus well just subtract 50 divided by the tile scale do we have to do that too tile scale probably tile Dot scale. Could put that in a variable, make it shorter. Yeah, there, that looks a little bit more centered everywhere. Woohoo! Let's open that right up. Ready? Oh, that's a lot of them. <laughs> that's a big tile. Okay, so there we have shapes that are all uh, heading back to an ordered position. I am Dr. Abstract. This has been a Code in 5 Minutes with Zim. So uh, come on in and join us at zimjs.com. zimjs.com slash slack. zimjs.com slash discord. We'd love to hear from you. Have a great day. And thanks again, Carl, for the suggestions. That was fun. Cheers. <laughs>